Channel 3 Early Warning Weather with meteorologist Mike Cameron. Well, after a mighty cold day, a really cold start actually, where in some places temperatures were close to zero, we're now going to see milder weather work its way in. In fact, it's already actually starting to evolve. We've had some clouds roll in over the last several hours, and they're the precursor to milder air that's working in aloft. It's usually one of the first signs that you're going to have warmer weather. Some of these high clouds are coming in. That's going to continue to happen with them thickening. And because we have a deck of clouds overhead overnight, uh, there is a blanket. So some of that radiation that's trying to, to, to go away, you, that's, you're, you know, the radiation is trying to escape from the ground. Can't when there are clouds because it bumps back down. So that keeps it warmer. And then as we look towards uh, tomorrow, we are expecting to see after a snow shower that milder air here, it will have arrived. So all of these things are working towards us seeing milder weather as we look towards the next 24 hours. Now there are no snow showers now, but I did mention them because especially late tonight and early tomorrow morning, we could see a few. They're all part of the system that will be bringing in that milder air. Uh, you could see some of these out over the Great Lakes. So uh, this little system, most of the energy will be going to the north, but with this little system, there could be a few isolated flurries or snow showers, especially across northern Connecticut. And as I mentioned, very late tonight and more into tomorrow morning. So out there now, we do have just those thin clouds. Otherwise, it's quiet and dry in New Haven as it is in Hartford. If you're planning on going out tonight in Middletown, it will be in the 20s. You'll still want the winter gear. It's not like Springtime is going to be coming anytime soon. So any nighttime uh, festivities that you may be going to tonight, I would still definitely wear the winter gear. That 25 in Hartford, that 25 in New Haven, we'll still hold on to that through most of the night. In fact, temperatures might back off a few more degrees for a little while right around midnight before then buoying back up again uh, as we look closer to morning. Uh, and then tomorrow, we are expecting that milder weather to be here. We'll see maybe 40 to Torrington, to 44 in Hartford, to 46 in New Haven. Maybe Norwich will be at about 44. Uh, the warmest spot might be Bridgeport at 47. So this is definitely going to be warmer than it was today. Now our future cast tomorrow's weather today is going to show that through the evening hours, this isn't capturing the filmy clouds that we have overhead now, but they're there and they'll continue to be. Uh, after midnight, they'll thicken up some and you can see at 7 o'clock in the morning tomorrow, we'll have a lot of clouds. There'll be a little sun making its way through, but I think there'll be a lot of clouds in the sky. And there's even a suggestion of an isolated flurry uh, or a snow shower during the morning hours, mainly to our north. But we can't rule one out, especially in the first part of tomorrow. Uh, going into the afternoon, I think we'll see partly to cloudy skies, sometimes mainly cloudy skies, just a changeable sky. And through the day tomorrow, as you saw, temperatures will be running in the 40s. As we look towards the evening hours, cooler air will be infiltrating. So by the time we talk about Monday, temperatures will back off some. But I think we'll see more sunshine during the day Monday. You can see how through noon and into the afternoon, it's going to be partly to mostly sunny then. So in your early warning seven day forecast, as I said, tomorrow we'll see temperatures running in the lower half of the 40s. Notice I put in that snow shower symbol in there in the morning for good measure. Otherwise, we'll have a changeable sky. Tomorrow will be an OK day. Monday, I think we'll have more sunshine than tomorrow. A lot of sun, in fact, but it will be a little bit cooler at 38 to 40. Then our next storm system will be Tuesday. And I think this is going to be another one of those situations where we'll have a wintry mix as this thing starts and it butts up against the cold air, but then a transition to warmer and just plain rain kind of weather will happen during the afternoon. And so I think more of that will be rain and plain rain than anything else with temperatures in the 40s. Once that leaves, we've got a punch of cold air in here that'll be here for Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Highs will only be in the 20s and mm -hmm. low 30s. And especially Wednesday night and Thursday night, we could be talking about lows in the single digits again. again. So.